Hey everybody, uh, welcome to our weekend check-in video for Sci-5 Social Psychology for Saturday, September 11th. So I'm just going to go over a few items as I always do, reminders, clarifications, updates, etc. All designed to help you keep on top of everything in our course and be successful. So let's just get right to it here. Our first item is that your uh, current chapter, chapter 4 for this week, the uh, quiz and discussion for that were due yesterday there on Friday. And a lot of you already submitted there early as I'm recording this here. And I really enjoyed uh, the remarks she made about what uh, we believe fake news to be and what we might uh, want to do about it. Some of you are like really thorough, like uber thorough, and really had some great insights, and I love to see that stuff. So I hope that the rest of you are taking some time to read some of your classmates' comments there, because some of them are just really great, and uh, I'm really impressed by that. Uh, next chapter, chapter five there on attribution. Uh, that will be due uh, next Friday regarding your quiz and discussion for that item there on the 17th. It's a pretty interesting chapter because uh, part of the discussion there is all about blame. And uh, that's certainly some something that uh, we all get kind of caught up in sometimes, that blame game kind of thing. But uh, I want you to take a look at that, and I hope you enjoy the discussion there. It's uh, pretty interesting, or, or so I think, as I wrote it. <laughs> uh, next item here is that your uh, inquisitive chapters for this unit, chapters 3, 4, and 5. Uh, just make sure that you're uh, working on those so you don't have to try to do them all there right before the next exam opens up there. Uh, per recent announcements and my last videos there, I did mention that the publisher has is kind of beta testing or testing out some new interactive features on a few of the illustrations, that is, graphs mostly from uh, the Chapter 3 content in the ebook and the Inquisitive assignments there. They're the same illustrations there. And they just would like you to participate in a very short uh, feedback survey there about what you think about the ability to interact a bit more than usual with these uh, graphs, so they basically added some bells and whistles, and they're thinking about revising a lot of the content that way to make it a bit more interactive when it comes to some of those illustrations, so please do uh, complete that survey. It won't affect your grade or anything if you do it or not, but uh, please do take a look. It'll uh, be good for the publisher to uh, see what they can improve uh, based on your comments there. Uh, next item here is make sure you're watching those uh, lecture videos there. Uh, they are designed to help you master some of the material, and believe it or not, I do say some pretty great things once in a while. Uh, they may seem like a lot to watch, but again, you're not getting anything else that I didn't present in the uh, live face-to-face -face classes there. And you do have the blessing of being able to stop and pause and rewind or just skip it all together if you want to, which you really can't do in a face-to-face uh, -face class, so take advantage of a little technology goodies that are afforded to you in this online format. And uh, last thing here is that uh, if you're able to make it to one of our live sessions, our next one is this coming Monday. It would be great to see some of you, so please do attend if you can. And if you are unable to do so, I do record those and post those later, so uh, please check those out. They're pretty much like we do here. Uh, sometimes people have questions I like to answer, so uh, again, if you can attend, great. If you can't, uh, no worries because they are not required. Otherwise, uh, like I said, work ahead on your assignments there as you're able to do so to knock those out of the way. And uh, have a great weekend there. And if you need anything, uh, please reach out via email. I'll be glad to get back to you uh, pretty quickly. And those of you that have email probably notice that I get back to you pretty fast there. So uh, uh, please do reach out if you need something. And uh, hopefully I will see you in class on Monday or in the lecture video. So uh, take care until then.